Hey guys, Griffboy1998 here, and I'm back with some more redstoning. This here is my chicken farm. As you can see in the distance, I've done several other designs, but I believe this one is the best design yet. There's this stuff here, which hasn't been in the previous episode, but, well, previous redstoning chicken farm thing, but this one has it. This is back again with the levers. Click this one. Um, and the guy was calling me. This one, it brings you off this way and it'll take you down. There's sometimes a glitch when one of these, when the pistons above would uh, come down on you, but uh, it's not there this time. So let's come down. Let's flick this one up. Okay, and what do we have? It, it goes straight through. Oh, this, there we go. My bad. It'll take you straight down this way. Guess I broke a block. Let's go down here, and you know it's the same thing you guys always done. Let's flick this one to go right. There's just one problem with this is I fixed it before in another video. I just in another chicken farm attempt, but I don't know how I did that one. What it was is um, well what this is is you flick the right one, it opens the left passage. Flick the left one, it opens the right passage. And now you have these two lamps. These two lamps are just there for an extra. Like you know, reminder thingy that uh, when they're when they're on, it means this one's it's closed. So this one's open, it means it's this one's off. So it means it's open there. So let's flick that one off. Come back and it's on. All right, that's just an extra way of getting lighting. And let me show the rest of the wiring for that one. Let's do it on the bottom first, cause it's the bottom and the top are exactly the same. If you look at it, really, they actually go straight together. See? Do 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 do. They're exactly the same wiring. I'm getting a Skype message. All right, let's go down. So here, as you can see, it's an AND gate, right? So when one of these two are flicked up, up, this one here would turn on, and this turning this block on, causing this redstone wiring to go on, and that would power this redstone dust. This redstone dust. There's this one here, but that's I'll explain it later. This one over here can only power this. Because the amount of wiring, the amount of lighting it ha uh, powered it is, it doesn't reach that one. So, can't power anymore. And it's the same with the other side over here. Goes all the way up to here. But, let's say if we flick one of them. Let's go down. Let's flick the left one. Just Okay. Sorry, I have like, I have a slow computer, guys. If I flick the left one, this thing turns on, right? causing this no longer to be powered this again since I didn't flick the right one this one the right one's not powered causing none of these to be on right but the left one this is now on right this see this one's not on so this one's on this has the power to reach to that one and to that piston okay the reason I could have done this a lot easier if I had uh, repeaters but I didn't use repeaters for a reason because I wanted to bring a point out, guys. People don't know how much, how you, sorry, how useful chickens and um, other stuff are. They they take too much pride with the cows and yeah, pretty much just cows because they have leather too, right? Cows, pigs, and um, repeaters. Yeah. So this one it uses none of those. Now that's that. You could just come up throw them up here right do, 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 do. but there's just one thing I want to show you guys right there's this ladder you're wondering what the hell is this this one's in the last one let's go up this one up to the very top and what you have is these two extra pins these two pins here are backups as if we run out of those do anything how do those three run out well this pen and this pen I'll explain they're there for a reason I'll explain it after I show you guys this Okay, I stepped on that, and I'll step on it again, I guess. Does that make it? Alright, it makes it open, because it was already open, I guess, yeah. So, this here, there's this little wiring thing over here. Uh, that, it opens passages to these, so you can kill the chickens in these three original pens, as you've seen in the last videos. Alright? Oops, yeah, that's why, yeah. Sorry, I did some adjustments with this, and it's got glitchy on me. Boom, boom. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
that's the way you have to have it, guys. Not that way. I thought it was that way because it was shorter. I'm sorry, guys. Everyone makes mistakes in redstone sometimes. Yep, even a good person who knows a lot of redstone. Alright, so let's go down. So as you can see, this thing is over here, blah, blah, blah. So let's go out this way around, and you have another thing here, and you can kill the chickens there. And So you kill them all three of those. Come up, step on this pressure plate, and go down. If you guys have strong computers, that probably won't happen to you. And bam, they're all closed. That is to avoid the chickens coming out. So after you kill them all, come down this way, and you shoot them them all up back into the little places they could have been and I'm on the right passage don't and tada and you fixed everything really now let me show you the wiring for that see there's a pressure plate over there on sorry pressure plate on top of that block and a pressure plate on top of that block so this there's this rest and wire gets powered both directions once again no repeaters needed they reach around now we have the middle. The middle is something I want to show you guys later on. You can make the little bit more compact, but the thing is, it'd be powering these things sideways, and that ends up creating some sort of thingy that it gets glitchy. It gets glitchy alone without that either. But um, just let me just say one thing: you don't you just do it this way and up like that. Do do, and you really save yourself a couple of pieces of rest. So not much, but this avoids that glitch from happening more often. So if it presses there, it still reaches here, and now you see these things. You're wondering what these things are. This thing here is a flip-flop. Let me just explain it to you guys quickly, and you know what? If I place that there, nothing happens, right? Let's turn it off, and bam, it gets pushed aside. See like that? Now it can't power this anymore. So this this here, we just need an inverter so it comes up this way bam over here exactly the same just flipped the uh, leg flipped over on this side and the center the center is something because the thing is right this thing wasn't symmetrical and it was bugging me if I I went originally all throughout the right side it wasn't symmetrical and it was bugging me and if I was meant to do some stuff with it it would look weird so this side here torch 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 duh, 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 duh. This side here, I couldn't place any torches, otherwise it would screw this thing up. And if I, I could have done it another way, but then it wouldn't be symmetrical and blah, blah, blah. You know the whole story. So I ended up putting it um, piece, a couple pieces of redstone wiring on the top to this thing. And it's another of those flip-flop thingies. This one here is the same, just there's extra. It's I You don't really need that. You can just have this, actually have it like that way. But yeah, so that there is to um, help you out with some stuff. Then this place, I needed it to get down fast. So I decided to use this method instead of the that type of method. Because that was taking too much room. So this here is an easier to get through. That was a message on Skype. So this is easier to get through down. It takes you down two blocks every single one block to the forward. Two blocks down is pretty much it. Then once again, there's dual of it. One on this side and one on this side. You only need actually one side of it. But, you know, it wasn't symmetrical, so that's how I did that. So this is actually all the wiring in this whole thing. It ends up becoming quite a lot for just a chicken farm. And I believe, you know what, let's just count with you. Two, 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 uh, two, sorry, wait, wait, wait. One, two, three, four, five, six. That equals 12, 1 to 3, 1 to 3, that equals 6, plus 12 equals 18. I don't think that's right though. Wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 11 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Alright, 16, 18, whatever, 12, whatever number it is, that's how much uh, sticky pistons are. Not a lot, less than a blaze farm to be sure, but um, yeah, ah, uh, see this is the glitch guys, that happens. That sometimes doesn't happen, sometimes it does happen. Let me just quickly show you guys that. It's a random glitch thing that happens is that this stuff gets powered by nothing. It's just powered. Just wait a couple minutes, it gets unpowered really. It, it just happens sometimes, guys. It may be an inconvenience, but it'll get patched. Don't worry about it. So this is the chicken farm, in other words. 
the um, I personally I like to call it the chicken fish because in a way it looks like a fish guys see if you don't see it you don't see it it's just a fish just just it's a fish okay so thanks for watching this episode of redstoning with griffboy1998 and I hope you guys enjoyed this I will personally be making this chicken farm in my let's play world I don't know about you guys I don't think you guys might too much redstone involved but uh you know, thanks for watching this episode, guys, and toodles for now.